This is Minister Paul. I'm a watchman on the wall in Northern California, and it's 10 17, roughly 5 p.m. Pacific Center Time. You know, so I saw this picture on the Drudge Report earlier this morning. This was an event in uh, Texas yesterday with five former presidents, and uh, Lady Gaga, of all people. And I, I got a check in my spirit on this, and then I just closed it out. I began about my day. It's been about 10 hours now of thinking about this, pondering this, and most importantly, praying on this. And uh, this is a revelation I received from the Holy Spirit, and I want to put this out there. Just a quick video for today and let you know I'm working on something really big for tomorrow. Really big. And it's going to concern this map. So, I want to share with you what I'm receiving through the Holy Spirit here. There is no order to these former presidents at all. You know, as I look at this, uh, uh, Jimmy Carter on the left, you, if, if they were going to go in presidential order like they almost always do, uh, you know, I was in the Navy... In the early 80s, I served under uh, former President uh, George Bush right here. And Obama, we know, was the, the latest president we had before Donald Trump. And yet he's way over here. And he's leaning in. And then you have uh, Bill Clinton, who was president before Obama. And he's all the way over here on the right. And, and it just bothered me. And, and so I looked at something. Look, okay, Democrat Clinton, Democrat uh, Democrat Obama, and Democrat Carter. And then right in the middle are these two Bushes, Skull and Bones, Illuminati, all of them, right? And they're both Republicans. I be I cannot find any order to this. It's not by age. It, it's not by party. It's not by year served. It's Nothing is random with these photos, do you understand? So what they're doing is, I'm telling you, this is what I'm receiving. They are sending a message to President Trump, a warning to shut your mouth or be, insert word there, or be silenced. I'll just say that. Shut your mouth or be silenced. In special regards to this JFK uh, opening of these concealed classified documents that will expose so many government lies. And so they pose an Illuminati uh, person right here behind the two Bushes, the two Republicans, which Trump is a Republican, and one of them in the wheelchair. I'm going to tell you what's really freaky about this uh, George Bush Sr. here is he looks like machines are keeping him alive. I mean, literally, like he's sitting in a wheelchair, you know, half dead. I'm just telling you the truth, like the sheets are literally keeping them alive. Uh, and, and it's disturbing. Anyway, that's my take on that. And so I want to show you kind of what came to me. This is the, what they're, the message here is, you know, Donald Trump come into order out of this chaos message we're sending you or you will be silenced just like JFK was. And so I brought up some pictures of Marilyn Monroe. So take the white dress, the blonde hair, because we all know that she wears pretty much multiple outfits a day, right? And I'm thinking, well, why her? She's a she's a well-known, high-ranking member of the Illuminati. I'm like, why her? Well, because they are too. That that's why. So I brought up some pictures of Marilyn Monroe, and I just put with presidents. And, and you're going to start to understand the message here. Here's, uh, here's one president. Here's another. Here's Kennedy. And we'll just scroll down here. And uh, you'll notice a theme here. White dress or jacket and blonde hair. I don't know. Hold on. I don't know what this was. Let me go. <laughs> What, what, what's this, man? My bad. Who? 
I'm Marilyn Monroe's confidant. Yeah. Let, let me move on up. So I'm going to put Marilyn Monroe with JFK. And I just ask it, is there any co confirmation with you on this? I mean, so here's Marilyn Monroe and JFK. And uh, I'm just seeing a message here. I'm telling you, I'm seeing a message here. And so, like this, what's this? Marilyn Monroe called Jackie Kennedy about JFK affair. Says. And so what I did was I look up what's the exact day that JFK was assassinated, and it's today's ten twenty-two. It was eleven twenty-two, November twenty-second, and they have three days. And Trump's already said unless unless something major is revealed or happens, he's going to release the the JFK classified documents and. Uh, and then all of a sudden, these five guys, they meet here with, with Lady Gaga. It all out of order, no semblancy to, semblancy to it at all. And, and I mean, so let, let's look at, uh, let, let's look at this um, Lady Gaga here. <clears throat> and the very first thing I noticed that was very strange when I ran that Lady Gaga Illuminati, because why is she with former... Five former presidents. I mean, it, it, to me, it just don't fit. I'm telling you, it's they're sending out messages. Let, let's just examine the facts. George Bush Jr., W. Bush, he, he comes out and, uh, and, and he gives this horrible condemning uh, speech against Trump, and he's a Republican. And, and then... Um, and then Obama comes out on the same day, 1019. And he gives a horrible speech uh, about Trump. And then all of a sudden today, Carter's coming out and he's, he's, he's praising the people defending Trump and saying attacking him is absolutely wrong. And he's all the way over here on the left with a forced smile. And it, it, you'll start forming a picture in your head here. So... I brought up this article to go see it. Lady Gaga's uh, February Super Bowl act, I'll call it. It was uh, claimed, most people believe that it was a satanic, it was a satanic display. And you notice right now, I go to look it up and it's gone. The video says it's gone. I'll refresh it. It's been removed. But, but right here, it says the alt-right thinks Lady Gaga's Super Bowl performance uh, was a satanic ritual. And, and it's gone all of a sudden. And so it's just the timing of all these things. So in case who, people don't know who Lady Gaga really is, let, let's look at some pictures. All you got to do is put it in. Look, the all-seeing eye and the Illuminati symbol actually looks possessed right here. Multiple different colors and hairs and and uh, completely ultimately evil. And she's standing with five former presidents. They want order out of chaos and they want Trump gone. And uh, just ask yourself. And she's been exposed as Illuminati. And she does rituals. Is this right here a satanic ritual and warning sent to the sitting president, Donald J. Trump, who's about to release Kennedy documents on, and Kennedy was assassinated on November 22nd on, and this is 1022. Is that what this is? I honestly would like to hear your thoughts. This really troubles me. We're talking about five former presidents put in some type of random order with an Illuminati princess doing satanic rituals 
standing between the only two Republicans of them all, and one of them's in a wheelchair. Pray on it. I just, I wanted to put this out there, and I'll talk to you tomorrow about something really important.